Yes, <laughs> there, Captain Cook. Where are you hidden? Got to see Papa, Uncle Billy. Some other time, George. It's important. There's a squall in there. It's shaping up into a storm. Uncle Billy, telephone. Who is it? Bank examiner. Bank examiner. I should have called him yesterday. Switch it inside. I'm not crying, Mr. Potter. Uh -huh, you're begging. That's a whole lot of work. Well, all I'm asking for is 30 days more. Pop. Just a minute, son. Just 30 short days. I'll dig up that 5,000 somehow. Shut me up. Shut me up. Pop. Just Have you minute. put any real pressure on these people of yours to pay those mortgages? Time's up bad, Mr. Potter. A lot of these people are out of work. Well, foreclosed. I can't do that. These families have children. Pop. They're not my children. But they're somebody's children, Mr. Potter. Are you running a business or a charity war? Well, all right. Not I... with my money. Mr. Potter, what makes you such a hard skulled character? You have no family, no children. You can't begin to spend all the money you've got. Oh, I suppose I should give it to miserable failures like you and that idiot brother of yours to spend for me. He's not a failure. You George, can't say that about my father. Oh, George, You're George. not. You're the biggest man in town. Run along. Bigger than him. Run along. Bigger than everybody. Don't let him say that about you, Pop. All right, son. All right. Thanks. I'll talk to you tonight. Well, what's the answer? What? Why, that medicine should have been there an hour ago. It'll be over in five minutes for the plan. Where's Miss Blaine's voice of capsules? I you. Didn't you hear what I said? Yes, sir. I... What kind of tricks you playing in away? Well, why were you right into the living room right away? Don't you know that boy's very sick? Thank you, Rudy. Really, my soul here. You lazy loafer. Mr. Gower, you don't know what you're doing. You put something wrong in those capsules. I know you're on it. B, you got the telegram and you're upset. You put something bad in those capsules. It wasn't your fault, Mr. Gower. Just look and see what you did. Look at the bottle you took the powder from. It's poison, I tell you, it's poison. I know you feel bad. Oh. Don't hurt my sewer again. Oh, no, Don't no, hurt no, my no. sewer again. Oh, God. George. Oh, Mr. Gower, I would never tell anyone. I know you're feeling. I would have felt so. Hope to die, I won't. George. 